Hey, what's up guys? Uh, welcome back. This is your boy again. I'm Slink. How you guys doing? Welcome to another video. I hope you guys missed me. Huh? Adam Slink. Adam Slink here, viewers. I hope you actually missed this channel. Don't worry. It's going to be back really, really, really soon. Really, really soon, guys. And uh, like I've said before, I'm trying to bring up some certain stuff into it. And again, I want to make this announcement. You know, I've been making this announcement for a long time now, but I'm not serious about it. But this time I'm dead serious. I want to uh, kind of like bring in two persons into this uh, my channel, a, a lady and a guy. And if you reside in Abuja, I'm willing to pay. We can negotiate and I'm going to interview you and to know how you can speak and interact so that I can be, you know, yeah, Adam Slink Media would not just be about me alone. I want it to be about many other aspects, many people, not just me. So I'm trying to like create Adam Slink Media to be another different form. So if you are in Abuja and you are interested in YouTube and whatever, and you want to get into it, immediately making money from it, and uh, I'm open with uh, working with you. So make sure you hit me up at Adam Slink on, on Instagram. Then we can do a live a live uh, chat on, on, on WhatsApp. Then I interview you if you got it. And I want the person to resume us at January. No, January. Now it's December, I'm quite busy. But as at January, I would like that person to resume. So this is a public announcement. So if you are interested and you are in Abuja, Abuja resident only. I'm not a Lagos. I'm in Abuja. Abuja resident only. Then hit me up, guys. Hit me up. A man. I'm just looking for two persons. But as time goes on, because I'm also looking forward on doing some major things. As time goes on, I'm going to expand it and I might employ close to like ten persons because I'm going to go into a website. Uh, where we. I'm going to help open our own website, Instagram, and so many other things. I really need a lot of happy hands so that we can all make money together, you know, in this hard economy. So if you are interested, I just need two persons first. So maybe the towards the middle of next year, we can employ additional people, you know. So if you are interested, let me know. So let's move forward, guys, and uh, let's discuss about it. Of course, we saw the title of the video. Whiskey Hype Man, you know, Whiskey recently gave someone 20 million naira for Dash. For Dash, just like that, for Dash. 20 million ba, just like that. Hmm? Just like that. So, some people are not really, really happy because they believe uh, Whiskey should have spread that money. Instead of giving one person 20 million, Whiskey for spread that for 2, two million, give it to 10 persons so that they can use it to start life. He gave it to a hype man. His name is Money G. And this hype man already did do well for himself. And immediately after I gave this money to the hype man, the hype man immediately went on to buy his mom a car. Which for me, I don't know his pocket, but I think it's a really bad investment. But the only he knows the reason why he decided to buy his mom a car from that money. Or maybe he has he had planned before to buy that car. Or he has already bought the car. Even before whiskey decided to bless him, so that he get a pocket. But if he indeed, from that money, now he did buy car, <laughs> brother, you don't do well, or you don't do well at all. But all the same, whiskey did that, and whiskey has been in Nigeria now for a very long time, enjoying himself, you know, taking time off from performing and from going so many places, you no. Know? Just to chill with his family in Nigeria. You know, usually this kid is always in Ghana. If not abroad, in Ghana. He made Ghana his second home. But now he was in Lagos, really chilling in Lagos with his wife, Gina, and uh, his kids. That's really good. Connect with your family. You know, after the mother's death, Whiskey kind of like, I think he kind of like had a rethink about life to know that, oh, there are so many things that are valuable, more, the more than money. So he decided to spend a lot of time with his family. Which is really really nice though. So twenty million bar for that hype man, and you know a lot of people are already begging whiskey to, for whiskey to give them money. Now even portable, even compose one song for whiskey. Said, and even speaking of portable, portable is 
equally enjoying himself in Loki. You know, uh, the thing is that Potty Boy, uh, if you check his story so far, it's ridiculous and also it's kind of like inspired. You know? <laughs> because this guy, a few years ago, this guy was beaten mercilessly. A video of him naked, beating for stealing a phone. Then, a couple of months after that incident, this guy blew. He's a zoo. Then, after that, this guy was acting so, so rugged. The ruggedity online actually kind of like picked people's attention. Picks people's attention and then he moved from there. Having his own place, wife, and everything. And now, he got the attention of one of the biggest. UK rapper, who is equally from Nigeria, Skepta. He decided to woke up in UK because uh, Portable was in UK and Skepta reached out. Well, Skata reached out and the potty boy immediately went to Skepta to meet Skepta and he chilled. Skepta even bought him clothes, outfit, and took him along to uh to I don't know red I don't know if it if if it was a premiere or for a fashion show, but took him along with him with his friend to this uh to the red carpet and Tima Savage was also there as well. And not just only that, you know portable, you should be anger with portable. Portable wants you hmm, to bless him. No, just portable. No, they like just come meet you and you know bless her. Of course, you like her more, but you want you to bless him. And Skepta did just that. Apparently, Skepta count like five thousand pounds to this guy. It might be more than who, but what we saw there, the guy no fit even fit her for a pocket. You know, <laughs> portable baby, make it no even. Dream before, dream before, say, go even leave uh, Lagos. You don't reach UK, you don't reach UK. I'm so happy for him, though. I'm so happy for him. I'm so, 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 so happy for him. Very, very happy for him. So, the team is say, portable can never stop being portable. If portable stop being portable, it's going to lose relevance. So portable need to keep up with his rugidity, fighting and calling out anybody. I think just like anyone, portable is one of the celebrity in Nigeria that is free to insult anybody and get away with it. Portable can call out whiskey and get away with, with, with it. Call out David Doe and get away with it. Anybody, portable can decide to call that person out and get away with it. But no artist, no matter, no matter how big you are, you cannot get away with insulting other artists. They will blast even whiskey themselves. But Portable is the only entertainer in Nigeria that is allowed to call out any artist and also get away with it, not in the apple. Because of that is style. We already know Portable want trouble. He want trouble. That trouble you want is not like this regular celebrity that will compose himself. He already built a brand around that rugged So he need to stick keep up with that rugged If not, if you follow me. For the profit for yes. So guys, to end this video, let's talk about Asake. You know, the reason why some entertainers are scared to reveal. If they are in a relationship, both home, both Nigeria and abroad, most especially abroad, that's why you see some entertainers 
they will guess, 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 and can guess if they are in a relationship. The reason why they are scared to reveal if they are in a relationship is because of their fans. They have male fans, they have female fans. Female fans who do not indirectly do not want their favorite to be in a relationship. Yes, so you might wonder why these celebrities do not keep the relationship for long. It's because of that indirect bad wish from their fans. They don't want them to be in a stable relationship. That's why you can hardly see them in a stable relationship. But some people have been able to uh, remove themselves from that cycle. Some celebrities remove from themselves from that cycle, and some will even keep their relationship secret for years. Get married and do their stuff. Or some will just have a way of twisting it to the point that fans will start accepting it. Like David Dona. Come on, if David Dona is not with trauma, huh, fans will be very, very mad. So they have been able to successfully twist the whole thing. Huh? Well, Asake is currently uh, just recently unveiled his girl. I hope the last door. As I can know why I see the girl. So you guys, fans who are busy, not happy with it, which you want me the guy to order. Me the guy come meet you say for permission before he did in a relationship with you. As I care for skin is different from as I care for bed, from his personal heart, for house. So allow him to pick up whoever I want to be in a relationship with. Huh? Please leave him be.